Today I have a brand new video tutorial for y'all. How to make this Cheshire cat headband. And it was inspired by Roxasaurus. I'll leave a link down below to her video tutorial on how to do this makeup. Now let's get into the video. You will need worsted weight yarn in pink and purple. Today I'm using Red Heart Super Saver. Two headbands. They do not need to be the same color, but it is helpful if they have the little teeth. Scissors, measuring tape, large pom-pom maker, hot glue, and a glue gun. To get started on the Cheshire Cat ears, open one side of the pom-pom maker and wrap the purple yarn around about 25 times. Do not cut the yarn, but slide it over to the side. And now take the pink yarn and wrap it right next to the purple yarn about 25 times. Slide the pink over. Now you can cut the purple yarn and wrap it next to the pink yarn about 25 times. Slide the purple over. Cut the pink yarn and wrap it next to the purple yarn about 25 times. Cut the purple yarn, slide the pink yarn over, and wrap the purple yarn next to the pink yarn about 25 times. Slide the purple over. Cut the pink yarn and wrap it next to the purple yarn about 25 times. Slide the pink over. Cut the purple yarn and wrap it next to the pink yarn about 25 times. Cut the pink and purple yarn ends. Close the pom-pom maker and open the other side. We are going to do the same thing, but instead of wrapping 25 times, wrap it only about 5 times. Close the pom-pom maker, cut the yarn, Cut a piece of yarn and place the scissors in the gap around the pom-pom maker and cut the yarn all the way around. Take the piece of yarn and slide it in the gap all the way around the pom-pom maker and tie it tightly on the side that has less yarn. This will be the bottom and since there's less yarn, it'll be easier to make it flat. Open the pom-pom maker and slide the pom-pom out. Take scissors and trim the bottom flat, the sides up to a point, and then trim the front and back flat. You can leave it as shaggy as you would like. Make another Cheshire Cat ear. One headband will be the front and one will be the back. Take one headband and start on the front piece. Cut strands of yarn 18 inches long. Take three strands of yarn at a time and knot them on along the headband. I took purple yarn and made highlight strands for the bangs. This will also mark where my part is. In total, I had 17 groups of pink yarn strands and three groups of purple yarn strands. You can use more or less yarn and you can make the strands longer or shorter if you would like. This will be the back piece and it will also have the ears attached to it. Repeat the process for the front piece, but instead of having two purple groups of strands together, I spaced them evenly apart throughout. 
Again, I had 17 groups of pink yarn strands and three groups of purple yarn strands, but you can use more or less yarn if you would like. Now to attach the cat ears. Cut the ties off the bottom, spread open the bottom of the pom-pom, and squirt in some hot glue. Press firmly. Attach the other ear. Trim the ears if needed. Now add one more group of pink yarn strands right under each ear. This will cover the gap under the cat ears. Trim the hair if needed. To wear the Cheshire Cat headband, put the back headband on first and then put the front headband on and fix the part around your face. What are y'all going to be for Halloween? Comment below! I hope you liked this video tutorial. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, subscribe now and don't forget to hit the notification bell so every time I upload a new video, YouTube will notify you. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. Until next time, bye!